Minute MBA, three reasons why government shouldn't be run like a business. With Reaganism of the 1980s came the idealistic political stance that governments should be run like a business, with the president as both CEO and commander-in-chief and Americans as shareholders and customers. Here are three reasons why the government shouldn't be run like a business. One, profit versus people. A corporation's mission is to make profits. This isn't just good business sense, it's also a legally binding component of incorporating. Government's mission is to provide for all citizens through the common good, things like roads, schools, and police protection. In fact, if a government is profiting, then they are probably hoarding tax dollars for no good reason. Microsoft may be smart for keeping $36.1 billion in cash and liquid short-term investments, but the government would be letting people down if they sat on that much money and weren't using it to keep the country running. 2. Shareholders versus Citizens There are 535 people in Congress, the President, and 9 judges. All of these politicians and judges answer to over 300 million Americans. That's a lot of decision makers, but it's this system of checks and balances that works to ensure each person's voice is heard. It isn't perfect. Lobbyists, special interests, and corruption still exist. But consider the alternative. As a minor shareholder in a major company, you wouldn't even have the opportunity to vote on major business decisions, like whether or not to remove a failing CEO. 3. Customers versus Constituents Companies have the luxury of dumping a line of business because it isn't profitable, or choose to streamline their offerings to serve just one sector of the population. Government agencies do not have this option. This is a good thing. Imagine if Apple ran the government. Fire and police departments would only answer calls to the homes of 20-something hipsters, we'd all have to use iTunes to file our taxes, and all legal disputes would be resolved at the Genius Bar. It would be horrible. For more videos from Minute MBA, check out onlinenba.com slash videos.